Before we get back into Guts Frisbee action, I just want to show the way my hand hovers over Elizabeth's staticky hair and moves. I think it's the turf, you guys. It's the turf. There's a lot of static electricity in here. You're not the only one. I just thought this was kind of fun because it's like magic. I've been shuffling. I've been shuffling my feet. I think, look how dirty my pants are from the turf. I, I never knew. I never knew. I never knew turf could get so dirty. <laughs> anyway, okay. Well, we've been kind of getting a little bit of instruction uh -huh. on our throws, learning that we have to kind of like start a lawnmower and go across, right? Break a window pane with your elbow. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to maybe try to put some of that into play. But all in all, I feel like we're doing okay. Not we both bad. scored. I I could work on my catching a little bit, but my throws were a little tiny bit better, I think. Maybe. I also realized like our throws compared to their throws are very different. Theirs are very, very fast and hard. How fast is a norm? Like, if if you had, like, you said you're gonna have the mm -hmm. the radar thing out here. How how fast are some Mo of these? Most going? shots are in the 50s and 60 mile an hour range, but uh, some guys can throw up to 85 miles an wow. hour. Wow, I thought okay. I was gonna so, do a 72. And, <laughs> and, and and so the thing is, is that you're only 15 yards apart. So mathematically, it's like 100 and four mile an hour fastball wow. coming at you with the disc. And you don't have distance. a glove on. I mean, not not the kind of glove You're, that you see Yeah, in but hey, you girls are scoring right <laughs> off the bat. Gloves are for wussies, right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so, no, that's really cool. I'm glad. And you can take it up. And in one or two practices, you can be pretty good at it and have a good time. We have yeah. women who play and kids who play. And everybody loves uh, walking in new t newcomers because we want to grow the sport. So that's sure. really exciting to, yeah. to have you guys covering this. All right. Okay, we'll, we'll, yeah, we'll hand we'll, it off. I, all right, I'm the mic man. Fingertips apart. Outstanding three for three for Elizabeth on scoring. Yeah, she did. So here's Gabe, our youngest player in the tournament. Steps in, but didn't quite get it. Yeah. She got a point. You got to throw back. Yep. Break that plane of glass. A little high. Sh throw, throw for. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah like that. Literally, yeah. Oh man. <laughs> On TV. He didn't do a throwback practice. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Tia, you can do it. Okay, shoulder, shoulder, straight back. Oh! Much better. Yeah, you're also five yards further than where you're going. One more time. One last throw. One more, one more. Just one more red. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. Right. Outstanding. Outstanding. We could actually probably do this all day long, but we do have to take another break. So uh, we will wrap all this up, let you know. It's, we have one segment left? One segment left. Holy cow, it's going by so fast. But we want to make sure that we give you all the tournament information before we leave. Ooh, <laughs> their throws are so different from our throws, Tia. Ouch. I'm not playing anytime soon. I'm not playing with them anytime soon. You come out and watch, though. It's just such a great spectator sport. We just want to fill the dome. It's a great spectator spader sport for the family. Once you give it a try once, you'll you'll be you'll come back for sure every time. All right, well we're going to let you know exactly when you need to be at the dome to catch some of this action. We'll be right back. <laughs> 